So one of the special features of Beyond that we are extremely proud of is our videos. And we have two video strands in Beyond and those video strands go through all six levels. One of the strands is called The Moving Picture and that's um, a series of videos that uh, feature on the opening double page spread of every unit. Those double page spreads are extremely visually impactful. They usually have a large image and sometimes some smaller images as well and straight away at the start of the unit the students engage with the content because it, it makes a huge impression on them. What the moving picture videos do on those opening spreads is to bring those pages to life. So we use a variety of video techniques, things like slideshows, YouTube videos, um, we put together commissioned uh, clips, we have Vox Pops questionnaires, we use researched videos and assemble them in a special way that fits the needs of the units. So all, they're never boring, there's all kinds of different techniques used to present that material on the page and to take it one step further by introducing the medium of film. The second video strand that we have is a video on every single speaking page. There's one speaking page in every unit and every one of those speaking pages has a specially written, specially commissioned video. Now this is where Robert Campbell's video experience comes back in because he was instrumental in helping us to devise this idea of having a group of 10 teenagers for every level and we refer to those teenagers as drama kids and um, we, we look for them, we write their character descriptions, we cast them, the scripts are written for them and we're heavily involved in the production with, um, with a video production company in Oxford. The thing that we love so much about Beyond and that's really at the heart of everything we do is the fact that the content is really new, really fresh and really vibrant and we really wanted to keep that right at the centre of, of everything that we made to support the course online and in the digital environment. So we've tried really hard to create a range of digital components, some using more traditional technologies and some with some brand new technologies that really keep the Beyond philosophy um, alive and really spread it in lots of different directions and support and enhance the course in lots of different ways. The first component that I want to talk to you about is the online workbook. Um, this is a pretty new uh, kind of component for uh, Macmillan, so Beyond is really at the forefront of what we're publishing right now. The online workbook is um, it's a really special uh, part of the course. We, we really wanted it to, to bring something new in. We didn't want to just recreate the experience of doing a CD-ROM just via a website. We wanted to really help teachers and help students to be better using it. So the great things about our online workbooks are the automatic marking, the fact that the teacher and the student gets instant feedback. Uh, the teacher can see the entire class um, and how they're doing. But as well as how they're doing, they can see how hard they're trying. So how many attempts has the student made on each activity? What things did they get stuck on? What things did they skip? What things did they then go back and do later? For students as well, there's also extra motivation in the online workbook. We've tried really hard to make the activities intuitive. It's swift to move through them. You want to keep kind of clicking through them and we're using that kind of inbuilt instinct that all teenagers have now that when they see an activity laid out on screen in an online environment, they kind of know what they're doing. The other component that I wanted to talk about is the Resource Centre, which is the bank of online materials that support and enhance all of the, the other Beyond Print materials. Um, we've got from the very traditional downloadable worksheets in culture, CLIL, life skills, extra grammar, extra vocabulary, uh, to some slightly more unusual things to support the course. So these are accessible, everything's accessible by the teacher, but the student also has access to the resource centre. And we think it's really important that they can also go online and get some important reference materials, some uh, access to all of the media for streaming and downloading, because part of Beyond is about developing this new kind of 
social awareness, a bit of an emotional conscience, uh, an awareness of how they learn and, and what things they need for their own learning journey. So for the teacher, basically the Resource Centre has pretty much everything you could dream of. We've got the fairly traditional extra grammar, extra vocabulary, CLIL worksheets, culture worksheets, life skills worksheets that are all photocopyable, you can just print them off and take them straight into the classroom. Um, but we've also got some slightly more unusual things, new hints and tips and little extra pieces of material to support teachers using the main students books as well. Another really exciting thing we have on the Resource Centre is we've partnered with One Stop English uh, to create a portal into their website and make some specific Beyond One Stop worksheets that take the, the one-stop style and some Beyond-style content. So last but not least, the, uh, the Resource Centre is also home to all of the Beyond tests and we have the full suite of those. Uh, we have static PDF tests, placement tests, mid-course tests, end-of-course tests, tests for every single unit and every single book. They're all there, they're all waiting. And they've been written very carefully to calibrate to the international exams and uh, to give students a realistic but still very Beyond-flavoured experience of testing.